Hi, my name is Pop. I'm making a video that shows how to use Zoom to a good advantage in Linux Ubuntu. I use Zoom a lot when I am making video tutorials, but you can use it for many instances. I'm going to start off by showing you the keyboard and what you can do with Zoom. This is the current layout. When I opened it up, it's centered in the middle of the screen here. I'm going to use Compiz to put it at the bottom left. Now when I moved it with Compiz, this is incidental information, I hit Control Alt and then one of the 10 key keys. And I have another video tutorial that shows how to do this. But today I'm just going to concentrate on Zoom. I use the Windows key to initiate Zoom and I've got four keys that I do this with. The Windows key when I hold it down and four other keys. When I hit the Z key this small window will go full screen. When I hold the Windows key in one it goes back to where it is right now. When I hit the Windows key in two it goes full screen but it does not center the window it centers wherever the cursor is. And Windows 3 goes even bigger and it's larger than that and it's centered around where the cursor is. So let me demonstrate that real quick and then I'm going to show you some things you can do with it that you may be surprised to learn about. Now I'm going to hit Windows key and Z. It's full screen. And that's independent of where the cursor is. I will go Windows key 1 back again. Let me put the cursor way up here in the top right corner and I'll hit Windows Z again. Now Windows 1. You see where the cursor is is irrelevant. Windows Z, Windows 1. Now this time I'm going to hit Windows 2 and it should center somewhere about where the cursor is. And now I'll hit Windows 3 and it'll get even larger back to Windows 2, back to Windows 1, Windows Z. Let me show you some things you can do with this. It is quite amazing. Let's say you're opening up a folder and you've got a folder full of items you're going to open up variously sequentially with your word processor. I've got a folder here that has oh golly Moses what is it it's uh, all these files and let's say I want to open them up one at a time I'll just open up this one and I'm going to double tap on it it's an RTF file and there it is over there. Now I'm going to pretend like I'm editing it and then I'm going to do a control Q and it says do you want to save it? Now this popped up right here because it's a warning hey you've edited this so we want to give you the chance to save it before you discard it yes I want to save it. And since it's an RTF file another warning pops up and it says do you want to keep this format? Yes. So everything's closed and I'm back to the folder again. Now I'm going to do it again. Control Q save keep it's gone. Now 
please watch what happens automatically when I do this while it is zoomed full screen. I'm going to open this up and then I'm going to do a uh, Windows Z that's full screen. Same sequence edit control Q open the next one edit control Q enter enter this is very handy for you when you are editing and you want something full screen like this if you are visually impaired this is a good way to go you have enlarged all of the fonts at the top and they're full screen and they're rather clear now let me show you how you can set this up in Compiz. You go to System, Preferences, Compiz. Look up the word Zoom, Z-O-O. -O. And there we've got a check mark in Enhanced Zoom Desktop. And it's kind of tricky. Let me enlarge it again. Zoom in and out. I've got everything turned off, disabled. I'm not using the straightforward zoom whatsoever at all. Notice also I'm kind of keyboard centric. I'm not using the mouse or the trackpad at all. I'm using the keyboard. Mouse behavior. Disabled. What I am doing here is specific zoom and there are three zoom levels and I defined the first one as the one key that's just normal I'm gonna do it right now Windows key one and then the two key which is centered on wherever I have the cursor back to one the three key wherever I have the cursor is where it will center or attempt to I'll do it again three and two and one those are three of my keys Windows key one two and three here's the fourth key zoom area movement fit zoomed area to window and that is the windows key and Z when I go windows key and Z it fills the screen with whatever window I'm on if I go over here to this one all I have to do is move to it. I don't have to touch anything. I can get off screen. Now here I am. The cursor is over here to the left and I just tap the trackpad. You can have as many windows open as you want. Windows key one. Let me demonstrate that and open up a couple more places. Uh, here's documents I'll open that I'm gonna go to documents control Z go up touch it go across touch it it's very handy going across here to focus tracking nothing animation nothing to go over it again nothing in zoom and in and out all disabled mouse behavior but specific zoom I've got one two and three and zoom area movement I don't really have anything there disabled 
yes I have it right here fit zoomed area to window windows Z I've got zoom area movement and three specific zooms you can use this very nicely when you're doing such things as using a paint program if you want to really really zoom in on something while you're editing a picture my name is pop I have a whole bunch of YouTube videos this is under Ubuntu basics I have other videos on other subjects and I thank you very much